First we had Soviet Jewry, then we had the Swiss banks, we had Waldheim. The World Jewish Congress played an important role in developing the jurisprudence in prosecuting the crimes against the Jewish people. We are here this morning to consider the question of whether Jewish survivors of the Holocaust were given back their family possessions and assets after World War II. There is almost nobody speaking up for Israel. We have to find a way to speak out for Israel. It is the diplomatic arm of our Jewish people. And um, for that reason and all kinds of subjects, uh, we uh, need to be a member of the Jewish Congress. We encourage synagogue-mosque relationships. We encourage relationships between Jewish schools and Muslim schools. We encourage Jewish and Muslim involvement in interfaith activity. El Cardenal Bergoglio siempre mantuvo una relación amistosa con la comunidad judía. I think that two to three hundred thousand. Jews perished in Nazi, in Nazi concentration camps, but nothing like, uh, that none of them by a gas chamber. I believe there were no gas chambers. We have to fight this phenomena now because racism, anti-Semitism, xenophobia are against the very basic values of democracy. The generation after the Holocaust will not stand by, uh, and hopefully other nations will join us in uh, not allowing anyone to threaten a nation. We knew Iran, Inamia, in the Jewish center of bombing attack. And for us, it's a big concern because Argentina's judiciary are claiming for uh, some officers of the Iranian government. We are working very hard at the United Nations, which is in our backyard and uh, all the issues that concern Israel and the Jewish people in the international body. The World Jewish Congress has got a critically important role to represent the views of the Jewish world to the world. These are very difficult times for the Jewish people. 
And thank God there is a World Jewish Congress because I don't know of any other organization that encompasses the whole Jewish world the way the World Jewish Congress does. And when we go and we go to different countries and see world leaders, it's very obvious the respect they have for the World Jewish Congress and what can be done. This respect was built over many, many, many years of working together. And I think I see the future very bright, but I also see the future filled with major challenges that the World Jewish Congress can, can accomplish.